Annual core inflation declined to 3.3% from 3.5% in October 2017, supported by the stability of the exchange rate in the last 12 months. Annual electricity, fuels, and utilities inflation also declined to 13.7% in November 2017 from 14.1% in October 2017. Domestic economic activity continues to strengthen as financial conditions ease and agricultural output returns to normal. The revised gross domestic product data for financial year 2016-17 released by UBOS indicates that the economy grew at 4% driven by improved performance of the agricultural and services sectors. Private consumption also improved in financial year 2016-17 relative to the previous two years. GDP growth is projected to rise by 5% in 2017-2018. Indeed, the Composite Index of Economic Activity, which is the Bank of Uganda's high-frequency indicator of economic activity, points to a strengthening of economic activity in the first four months of financial year 2017-2018. In the medium term, the economy is expected to expand at a faster pace, boosted by public investments, growth in consumption, and the current stimulatory monetary policy. There are, however, several domestic factors that pose risks to economic outlook. Growth has not been even across all sectors. In addition, the cost of credit is high, and non-performing loans remain relatively high with the possibility that this will constrain credit extension. The near-term inflation outlook remains subdued, but core inflation is projected to pick up in, 20, in financial year 2018-19 to around 5% as spare capacity in the economy is reduced. Nonetheless, there are upside risks to this outlook, including the future direction of food uh, crops prices and the path of uh, the exchange rate, with the latter contingent on external economic environment. Based on the outlook for inflation and economic activity, together with an expansionary fiscal policy in financial year 2017-18, and the evolution of risks and uncertainties, the Bank of Uganda judges that the current stance of monetary policy remains appropriate. The bank will therefore maintain the central bank rate at 9.5%. The band on the CBR will be maintained at plus minus three percentage points, and the margin on the rediscount rate at four percentage points on the CBR. Consequently, the rediscount rate and the bank rate will remain at 13.5% and 14.5% respectively. That is our monetary policy statement for December.